Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new and first video as well uh, on this channel of uh, Zurich Model Airport and uh, basically what I will do today is that I'll present a bit about myself not too much but you know just so you get to know me a bit and uh, what this channel will be about so first of all we'll begin with what is this well uh, it's it's a channel about uh, my model airport which is supposed to um, resemble Zurich uh, in Switzerland uh, now I know it's not really exactly how it is uh, it's not like completely accurate because this terminal is actually supposed to be over there and there's supposed to be another runway that's supposed to cross here although this though this is pretty accurate and that the runway 16 starts there this is all just th this part here is pretty accurate to the real thing this part this is just an addition that i added when i was like 13 when i actually made this entire thing so i mean it's pretty interesting because it's not too bad uh, if you think about that a 13 year old made this but yes this is it and um, yeah basically what i'll do is i'll have these airplane models i can actually show some so aircraft like these and i'll basically uh, talk about the routes where they will go where where they have arrived from and stuff and uh, what my goal is is that i'm supposed to like collect every single aircraft that flies to zurich and try to like make these airport updates that replicate the whole entire actual thing so like if there's a flight in 10:40, for example uh, pm uh, in real life i will try to uh, buy that plane and uh, have it on here and make videos about the airport basically it's it's pretty simple and now so more facts about the aircraft i uh, buy and use and order and stuff uh, let's start off with the brand usually it's gonna be herpa uh, and in scale 1 to 500 uh, i will uh, use 1 to 600 and now in the beginning since i b before i started to uh, collect the 1 to 500 scale aircraft i bought a bunch of 1 to 600 scale aircraft because i had no idea that the quality difference was so big and obviously 1 to 600 was way cheaper and yeah i mean i was like 11 when i bought all of these 1 to 600 scale aircraft but these two as you can see right here the swiss a220 and the uh, iceland air 757 are both uh, herpa 1 to 500 scale aircraft and i'm probably gonna stick with that scale as well because my airport is basically 1 to 500 except the fact that my runway is a bit too huge on the airport but yeah so basically if we go over here to the international terminals we have a 1 to 600 aircraft which is a boeing 777 300 er uh, the livery doesn't really matter now when it's scale and here is another 777 although this is a 200 you can still tell the difference that this one is slightly wider so this one is in 1 to 500 and this one is in 1 to 600 you can obviously tell the difference especially if we like look at the cockpit the landing gear the engines themselves they have much more details and this is not a herpa actually this is a uh, sky 500 model although it's still in 1 to 500 and that's what matters for me and then when we look at the cockpit here and the landing gear, you see how cheap and poorly made it is compared to the 1 to 500, which looks way more like realistic. And if we turn the plane around, you can also see the luggage, the luggage area down there and down there as well. On this one, you can't because this this one is way more cheaper and. Uh, yeah, it's not the same quality as you're gonna get on a 1 to 500 aircraft. So, that's pretty much it. I'm not sure exactly when uh, I will start uploading videos uh, like model airport update videos. 
but uh, expect an unboxing pretty soon. I'm not sure when uh, the two aircraft I have ordered will arrive, but I'm hoping that they will arrive pretty soon. There's just one problem, uh, and that is that I ordered a Air Serbia A330-200, uh, uh, also by Herpine, 1 to 500 scale. And uh, the thing is, I, w I did not realize that it was not like released just yet. Although, the aircraft should be released pretty soon, so I hope that I will receive it with my Scandinavian uh, Airbus A320neo that I also ordered with it. But uh, yeah, let's hope for the best and that I receive those aircraft in good time. And as soon as I get them, I will make an unboxing video. I'll do a little review about them. So yeah, that's all for me. I hope this channel actually becomes a thing and I, because I really like the idea of it. I was inspired by some other YouTubers. Uh, so yeah, and don't forget to subscribe if you're interested in this type of content and why not drop a like because I mean, hey, it helps me out somehow. Uh, so yeah, thanks.